quickest way to check where the time goes is probably <coughs> to first run this in the profiler, which only works from the GUI, unfortunately. So I try to avoid the, the IDE GUI as much as possible because I hate those things. They are so slow and unproductive and just unenjoyable in general. Look just at the startup time. I mean, this thing takes longer to get its windows straight than, than my program takes to parse the symbol dictionaries 50 times. This is crazy. In Visual Studio 2019, I think you can no longer start the sampling profiler from the command line. Imagine that. How crazy is that? Are they actually still targeting developers? Isn't it nice how they implemented the, the progress bar here? And as a compulsive person, I immediately noticed that they didn't align the 100% with the other percentages. Also they, also, they print percent percent, which is funny. They were probably so used to printf formatting that they wrote a double percent. And didn't, but nobody noticed, it seems. It's somehow an indication of how much actual care goes into these products. That nobody noticed it's such a thing. Or maybe not even noticed, maybe also of the internal processes that they have. They might have so much overhead that nobody bothers to, to file such, such a thing. Or, Tell somebody, because you probably have to open a problem report as a tester if you notice something like that. And developers will hate you for doing that because they have to fill out so many forms in the process of fixing it. And yeah, maybe there even is some deep down in the words of Microsoft, maybe there is a problem report mentioning that the progress bar has a double percent sign. The problem is that these reports, they are huge. The profiling reports, they have gigabytes. It always puts it in your temp directory. So I moved the temp directory to the secondary SSD. That was very annoying. I mean, why don't you have, why, why is there no setting where to put, that's crazy, where to put the, these huge files? Is this completely hopeless here? I think this is completely hopeless. People, I, I will throw this away, this garbage Visual Studio. This is not even, it is not even able to profile a small real world program.